is Randy Santel. Atlas and I am very, very excited tonight. I'm going for overall win number 976 and I am back in the great city of Des Moines, Iowa. We've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. <laughs> this place is filled. I am for the first time here at Mullets. I'm the first person to take on and help kick off their brand new Pigs in a Blanket Challenge. Now, they've got all kinds of food here, tons of drinks. I know they're known for their Bloody Marys. They're also known for their breakfast, but we've got a whole bunch of breakfast here. We've got four of their stacked sweet cream plate-sized pancakes. Uh, pretty much each one is about one pound. So we got like little under four pounds of pancakes. And then in between, we've got layered. They've got a whole bunch of barbecue here too. We've got over a pound and a half about a half a pound on each layer of their sweet hickory barbecue pulled pork, which they smoke here. So we've got all that. And then on top, we've got six sunny side up eggs. So we've got all this. We do have a one hour time limit, but I do have to shut up and eat. These pancakes are gonna get like concrete, but if I fail, it's gonna be $39.99. But if I win, I'll get my meal free. I will get a sweet t-shirt to add to my collection and I'll be the very first person here on the upcoming Mullets Wall of Fame. Let's get this challenge started. <laughs> all right, coming off that big adventure with all that chocolate and Italian gelato at Chocolatery Stam up in Ames, which is like 45 minutes north of here. But it's time to eat some breakfast. Big thank you to the owner, Mr. John, and then the head chef. He's been the head chef here at Mullets for like 11 years now, Arturo. He put all this together. He also smoked the pulled pork. So thank you to him. We'll give compliments later after we taste it, but let's shut up and eat. One, two, three, boom. Ooh. All right, I'm gonna save on some of these eggs, roll these up, and have some pancakes to start. Uh, I do have a Mullet's Light beer here. It is optional, I just wanted to show it off and we got some branding for them in the video. I gotta make sure I don't drink too much water getting these pancakes down, but this pulled pork looks juicy. Let's try it. Wow. That is gonna go right down. I don't need water for that. The sunny side up eggs. I'm kind of scared to drink this beer while I'm eating pancakes. I haven't had beer and pancakes since college round one. I don't want the eggs to get too cold, so I'm gonna eat them now. I'm glad I'm not eating chocolate today, though. It's been a weird 24 hours. Ooh. All right, done with the top layer. Let's have pancake number two. How do the pancakes come usually? Are they in stacks or? Much smaller. <laughs> Much smaller, I do believe that. I'm gonna have an healthy orange for breakfast tomorrow. Ready, 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 ready. have some of this pulled pork, some more of this pulled pork. I imagine that is very delightful with some coleslaw on a sandwich.
This doesn't look like much when it's sitting in front of you, but once you start biting into it, this is a lot of food. All right, back to pancake. We are 10 minutes, 25 seconds in. We are gonna get it. Just gonna keep on chewing, biting away. Chuck the beer! <laughs> Maybe at the end, but definitely not now. Ooh. All right. Done with pancake number two. We've got uh, two thirds of the pulled pork done and then all of the eggs done and half the pancake. There's some challenges that are just four or five pounds of pancake. This also has six eggs and over a pound and a half of pulled pork. We are gonna get it, still under 15 minutes in. Last bits of pancake number three. I am getting full, but I'm always doing okay. People drive hours from all around to watch the guy eat. That is pretty cool. And much appreciated. We're 18 minutes in and I'm enjoying these pancakes, but the pulled pork is definitely my favorite part. Very good pulled pork. It is by no means lean, but it is flavorful and delicious. All the chocolate I had yesterday uh, kind of messed me up. Dessert is, is mullet's light beer. There's no, no sweets tonight. I'm done with dessert for a while. All right, feeling better. We're good now. I am really look like, looking like a sissy on this, but a win is a win. We do know Molly would be done already. All that in a diet, huh? Yes. Yeah, if you're gonna eat like this, you gotta have a diet soda. <laughs> All right, that was given to me by John, the owner. Thank you to him for having me in. Let's get this last pancake down. 21 minutes, 35 seconds. I was actually thinking a half hour for this challenge, but uh, John, the owner, wanted to do an hour, so I'm glad that we did that. Pancakes is not my strong suit, as you can see, but we are getting it. We got this. Gotta make sure I sop up all the egg yolk. there, 26.55. Done with over five pounds of food, we got this. We wanted to create a challenge in Des Moines that was doable, and this one's definitely doable. But it is definitely not one you can just wake up and decide to try either. This is uh, surprisingly difficult, but we're gonna get it.
That was such a delicious new pigs in a blanket challenge. Those blankets on that thing were amazing, but very thick, all those pancakes. But yeah, 28 minutes and 32 seconds is the first time the new record debate here at Mullets in Des Moines, Iowa. Thank you guys all for being here. I really enjoyed the sweet cream pancakes, but my favorite in between all those, that sweet hickory barbecue pulled pork that they make here with their own Mullets barbecue sauce. That was amazing, really enjoyed that. I bet it's delicious on a pulled pork sandwich with some coleslaw, Carolina style. But I also enjoyed the eggs on top. Those help the pancakes and everything go down. But I am the first to win, so I am going to get the $39.99 meal for free. I will get a sweet t-shirt, which John has already given to me. It just has their logo, and it's got mullets on the front. I will have my name and photo up here at Mullets on the Wall of Fame. So big thank you to John, uh, the head chef, Arturo, everybody here with Mullets. That was a delicious win number 976. I was too scared to have this during the challenge, so I will end with it. It is, they're made specially for them, their Mullets light beer. So thank you guys all for being here. I've got another challenge coming up tomorrow in Des Moines, but Miss Freddy! Yeah.